Xiaomi is launching a new notebook globally in the form of the Book 14, which features two different Intel processors and a high-resolution 2.8K display with 120 Hz. So hey everyone, I am Ayush, and if you are new here, don't be shy to subscribe now. Xiaomi has announced a new notebook for the global market, namely the Xiaomi Book 14, which was recently added to the manufacturer's global website. The laptop is available in two versions and is largely reminiscent of the Redmi Book 14 that was introduced in China some time ago. The more powerful and more expensive version of the Xiaomi Book 14 is equipped with the Intel Core i5-12500H with a clock speed of up to 4.5 GHz and Intel Iris X graphics. It also comes with 16GB of LPDDR5 RAM and 512GB of storage on a PCI 4.0 SSD. Alternatively, the manufacturer is offering the Xiaomi Book 14 with the Intel Core i3-1220P, which also comes from the 12th generation of Intel and clocks up to 4.4GHz. This is flanked by Intel UHD graphics 8GB LPDDR5 RAM and a 256GB PCI 4.0 SSD. In both cases, the new Book 14 from Xiaomi has a 14-inch screen with 2.8K resolution, 2880x1800, and a refresh rate up to 120Hz. It reaches a brightness of 300 nits, has a contrast ratio of 1,500 to 1, and covers 100% of the Sarah GB color space. In addition to a 56 volt battery for up to almost 12 hours of battery life, various connections such as HDMI 2.1 and USB-C 3.2 Gen 2 as well as Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.2 are on board. The laptop comes with a 100 hilly power supply and a pre-installed Windows 11 Home. Unfortunately, the global website does not reveal the prices of the two variants of the Xiaomi Book 14, nor is there any information about launch dates in other countries outside China. So, what are your thoughts on Xiaomi's global expansion with the new Book 14? Which version do you find more appealing, the Intel Core i5 or the i3? And are you eager to see how it competes with other laptops in the market? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more tech updates. I will see you in next one.